The Prime Minister does not speak. He remains silent. The Minister of Justice says nothing. And the police try as they might to make the announcements. They can offer no guidance, no comfort. We are in a difficult situation. The truth is, a leadership that is helpless does not deserve to lead. A government that is helpless does not deserve to govern. A prime minister who is helpless does not deserve the prestige of his office. He is the worst minister of national security we have had. And I just want you to remember how quickly our memories fade. That he's the same minister who had been appointed, had all the solutions for crime, whose advice, he claimed, was unheeded by the former administration. Now he is in the driver's seat. And what do we see? What do we see? An alarming increase in the number of homicides and incapacity to deal with the problem. I just want to make it clear that I, like most other citizens of the country, am not very happy, very concerned about the crime situation. Um, there seems to be a, a provision of crime throughout the region, which is which we feel in Indonesia.